Ever thought about cricket stars who should have been famous but weren't? Why didn't they make it big? Ready to find out about these amazing players and their journeys? Let's get started. 1. Sikandar Raza He's known for being good at both batting and bowling. Raza had some really good moments in cricket, showing that he could be a star. But he couldn't always play at his best. It makes you wonder, was it because of how his team was set up or maybe just bad luck? He had so much potential, but we didn't get to see him become one of the top players in the world. It's a story of what might have been. 2. Brendan Taylor Next is a man who hails from Zimbabwe. He is an exciting batsman and a smart wicketkeeper. Taylor played some amazing cricket, especially in World Cups. He showed he could be a great player, but couldn't keep that level all the time. Even though he had a lot of skill, he never became a big name in cricket. You have to wonder if he didn't get enough support or if the high-pressure world of international cricket was too much. His career is like a big question. What if he had the right conditions to shine? 3. Rashid Khan He's a fantastic spin bowler from Afghanistan and got attention pretty quickly. Rashid has done really well in T20 leagues all over the world. But in international cricket, he hasn't reached the top levels that many expected. His story isn't over yet though. Lots of people are still hoping he'll make a huge impact on the international stage. Next up, we have a cricketer whose tale is even more unexpected. Can you guess who it is? 4. Ryan Ten Dosshate An amazing batter in the lesser-known cricket world. He showed that he could compete with the best players. But since he was from a smaller cricket nation, he didn't get many big chances. His talent was clear, but the opportunities to play on the largest stages were limited. Ten Dosshade's career is a reminder of how being from a smaller cricketing country can limit a player's chances to shine on the world stage. 5. Paul Sterling He's an aggressive and strong batsman and has been really important for Irish cricket. Sterling is clearly talented, but he hasn't made a huge mark in global cricket. His career shows the struggles that players from emerging cricket nations often face. They have the skill, but sometimes they don't get as much attention or as many opportunities as players from the bigger cricket countries. Ready for another twist? Our next player's tale is full of surprises. Keep watching to discover who it is. 6. William Porterfield At 6, we have another Irish player. He's a talented left-handed batsman and was Ireland's captain. Porterfield led his team into test cricket but didn't make a big impact as a player in the international games. He showed great leadership but were left thinking about what more he could have achieved on the field. His career is a mix of solid skills and unfulfilled potential. Hit that subscribe button for more fascinating cricket stories and insights. Don't miss out next countdown. 7. Mohammed A. Sif He is a fantastic fast bowler from Pakistan, but his career ended badly because of a match-fixing scandal. Before that, he had taken 106 wickets in test matches, which is really good. But at 28, his career stopped suddenly in 2010. He was also banned once for using steroids. Azu's story is a warning about how making bad choices off the field can ruin a promising cricket career. 8. Mohamed Sami He started his career in 2001 in New Zealand. Sami was fast and had a great and swinging Yorker. He did really well in his first test match but couldn't keep that level of performance. His career shows how tough it can be to stay at the top in cricket. Even with a great start, it's hard to keep performing at your best all the time. 9. Chris Lynn He's an exciting batter, especially known for his performance in the IPL with Kolkata Knight Riders. Lynn scored a lot of runs there, but he didn't do as well in international cricket. He played only a few games and didn't score much. He had a lot of talent, but we never really saw him do his best for Australia. Lynn's story is about a great player who couldn't show his full potential on the international stage. Last not least, we have 10. Akash Chopra He is recognized for his ability to withstand tough conditions, made significant contributions to the Indian cricket team during his brief international time. Notably effective in the 2003 or 2004 Australia tour, he formed key partnerships with Virender Suwa. Despite his expertise in domestic cricket, Chopra struggled to convert starts into big scores internationally, leading to his eventual drop from the team in 2004 after 10 tests and 437 runs. However, he continued to excel in domestic cricket for Delhi and Rajasthan, highlighting his consistent performance and flexibility in the domestic circuit. To wrap it up, these 10 cricketers had amazing talent but did become big stars. Their stories show us that being great at cricket isn't always enough. Sometimes luck and chances matter a lot too. It's a lesson that sometimes even the best players face tough times and don't always get the fame they deserve. Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Let's keep the conversation alive.